Fort Valley's first Friday is back and bigger than before, and some people see it as an opportunity to help the city grow. Caitlin Sabater spoke with the owner of a local restaurant who's getting ready for the big night. First Friday in Fort Valley originally got its start at this gazebo, but come this Friday, this gazebo will just be the beginning spot of a street full of entertainment and food for everyone to enjoy. This is what First Fridays used to look like. Kevin Blaylock, the owner of 1836, the restaurant located across the street, started them in 2019. So we started with live entertainment. We wanted to do live bands under the gazebo, get that street party feel. Like so many other events, it was canceled once the pandemic hit. But now that restrictions have eased, First Friday is coming back. And uh, it, It's been hard on a lot of us. Just getting people out, I think it'll be awesome. The Peach Activity Committee, a nonprofit, teamed up with Blaylock. We want to see things happening in Fort Valley. There's nothing happening here. We want it family oriented, so it's inclusive of the whole city. Latonia Ages, president of the PAC committee, said you can expect food trucks, live music and dancers, rock climbing and other activities along East Church Street. From kids all the way up to the elderly, we're, we're offering something for the whole community. Ages said they're expecting a large turnout. In anywhere from 1,000 to 1,500 people to this event, if not more, because people have been shut in so much. And Blaylock thinks a turnout like that will be great for local businesses like his. And, you know, we're just trying to get back from COVID, get back and get everybody back out the house. He said First Fridays could also help with new growth. And I think First Friday provides that opportunity for others to come and see what we got here in Fort Valley. In Fort Valley, Caitlin Sabater, 13 WMAZ News. Now, First Friday is set for every month in the near future, except for June because of the Peach Festival.